Hello Lolas, welcome back to my channel. Guys, if you're new to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. Guys, I am here today to uh, get Milani changed and just give you an update really quickly. Um, I don't know what I have coming up for you guys, to be honest, but I do know that I am working in the background very hard on quite a bit of projects and um you know um so lots going on of course um my baby Christian well he's no longer going to be my baby but my twin B um baby is uh hair is rooted head is rooted so now um I'll be able to put him back together and take photos of him for um you guys to see before he travels home to his mommy um it's funny i probably told you guys before i actually told his mommy that it was done but um i'm really really excited about um that and then i'll have to make some hard decisions on who to send next to the rooter um as you guys know i have quite a bit of ball babies here and some babies you guys may not know that I've, you know, of course, been working on in the background. Um, you know, <laughs> it, it just works that way. You know, some stuff I share quite a bit of and excuse me one minute. So, I'm sorry, I'm acting like you guys are here, but I just need to. Mm. Um, yeah, that's not gonna work. Um, sorry. <laughs> I know this is so crazy. I am so crazy. I'm so sorry, guys. I actually looking at. <laughs> oh my gosh! Let me get this baby dress. Okay, I'm I'm sitting here and I'm looking over at um some baby parts limbs and i'm like wait a minute are they not are they not um matching or what am i doing here yeah, it's, i don't know brain all over the place so anyway this little outfit even though it says three to six months it looks fairly big for three to six months so i think she will be at milani will be able to fit this but then i remembered i had pajamas in there so i was like Mimi, I was saying Mimi needed pajamas, but I forgot I had these pajamas in my room closet. <laughs> of clothes everywhere. And I had this outfit also in my room closet. So I was like, if she can't fit this, I'll put it on her and put the other outfit on Milani later. Um, but yeah, so let's let's go ahead and see if we can get her dress. I feel like I'm going to be blocking the light. Let me see. If I can position myself here to where you guys can still see, but I'm not like totally blocking the light. Sometimes it's a tight squeeze in here with everything that I have going on. Okay, so Gabby making all her noise. Gabby, stop making all that noise. Um, people think I'm killing her or something. She's actually playing games and anyway, when you're like, she's not the only child, but she's the only child in the house at the time. So she entertains herself a lot of times. But anyway, as I was saying, I'm gonna have to make a hard decision on who I'm going to send next for, um, for rooting because I have Milani here and I have um, Memphis and I have Rico and I have um, Lulu um, that you guys haven't met yet. So um, it's just, it's always a, a hard decision 
on who goes next. But I think if I finish Grumpy, I'll probably, um, I might send Lulu. I might send, I, my intentions were to send Milani, but then I don't know by the time I get my spot available for rooting, Lulu probably will be ready for rooting. So it's always a hard decision when it comes to the reborns of who's going next. So um, I'm in a big baby phase a little bit because I, you know, like I said in my previous videos, I've decided I want to complete a set of babies. So it's pretty... It's gonna be pretty interesting for me because I am not typically a toddler mom or a big baby mom. Um, I do, however, really love Milani. I do have people asking to purchase her. And just to be fair, because you guys know how I am, I just told, I've just been telling people, basically, I need to see her um, once she gets rooted with hair and really make a f full decision if I'm going to keep her or not. I don't want to get anyone hopes up because I'm very good at wanting to keep the babies for a while, if not for good. So, But then I'm also very good at saying I'm going to keep them and then end up selling them. So right now I'm just going to leave it as... um. Let me let her get her hair first um, and decide if I'm going to keep her just simply because I did, you know, um, make leeway with Lulu and, you know, I don't, I need, I want to have, I know this is going to sound crazy. I want to have five awake babies, um, big, bigger babies, but I don't know. I wanted, I was going to do all like, you know, big, like toddler toddlers, but I was thinking Milani is big enough. She's not like a toddler, but right there at like crawling stage, in my opinion. Um, so I know she was sculpted after a three month old baby, but my Milani is going to be like, I'm going to say she's like 10 months even though she's probably more like a six month size I guess I don't know she's gonna I'm gonna say she's a chunky well I'm gonna say a chunky six month old how about that so we're gonna go with six months here and that's gonna be her age do you guys do that like try to think of age I really never really tried to like pinpoint the ages of my babies until you know, people just kept asking me, like, how old is, you know, Mimi? And I'm like, I don't know. Like, so Mimi is two and a half. She'll be three um, in a few months. So that's going to be her, her thing. So she'll be three. And then I'm going to have a two-year-old. So it'll be two, three, and maybe I'll have a four-year-old, and then the six-month-old, and then um, Phoenix is going to be like 15 months old. So that's what I'm thinking. That's just my my plan for now. That's the ages I'm thinking. So I'm gonna have four girls and one boy just like my real kids and that's how I plan to do it and eventually I will be doing like a role play series with my babies oh my gosh they do fit like perfect I knew it. I could look at it and see you know when you have like um like when my kids um and even with Gabby to this day but when the older kids were older I um I would guess I would be like in the store and have to try to guess and think if they could fit the clothes 
So I guess this is no different. I was looking at it, I'm like, I know it says three to six months, but this brand, this uh, Kyle and Dina, whatever that Marshalls be having, and Ross and all them, it it is their the brand is cut very big. So even though it says I need scissors, even though it says three to six months, I could clearly look at it and tell that it was a bigger size. And this headband is huge, which is great because her head is huge. So. Sorry for the ruder. But, uh, yeah, so her head is huge, so that's, that'll be perfect. And say, and I'm bald right now, so another reason why it's perfect, because it will, <laughs> it will fit me perfectly. I gotta get her some earrings. And I should have got her some socks. <laughs> to go on so yeah so I'm just thinking you know she really looks like she's big enough to be a toddler um but she just has such a baby face I don't want to say she's complete toddler mm, I think you could put on some of Mimi socks because these I don't want to put her on no lace socks so well, these socks don't really match, but let's see. We'll just put you on some anyway. How about that? We'll just put you on these anyway, even though they don't match. Just can't put on no lace socks. That's just wrong. So, yep. So, I am excited about everything that is coming up um can't wait to share lulu with you guys i always say i'm gonna wait till they get rooted before i share them but then i give in and i break and i show you guys before so let's see if i hold out <laughs> to show you guys lulu till she get rooted um i went ahead and showed uh milani because I knew it was going to be a while before she get to go because I end up sending um, Christian instead. So I decided to go ahead and show her so I can enjoy her on camera. And yeah, so aunties can go ahead and see that fat chunk of monk. Um, so yeah, we, so we got, we got little Miss Milani all dressed and ready so um that's it guys i don't have nothing else i um i did get memphis dress and but and i got mimi dressed again but i took her hair bows out so i gotta do her hair before you guys see her again and i moved aspen into a different spot so I've been moving babies around. I'm expecting a baby, a baby boy jersey um, soon. So Jersey will be here. And so we'll have, oh my gosh. So let me see if I can name all my babies really quick. <laughs> I don't know if I can, but I'll try. Okay. So I have, I'm cheating because I'm looking at them. So I have London, Lily Grace, Piper, um oh my gosh oh okay london lily grace piper kenya rico baby blessing pears me and more um amani i never changed his name yet um memphis mimi and aspen and Lulu, um, yeah, so that's, I don't know, but how many is that? London, Lily Grace, wait, let me do the, the, the thing. So it's Lily Grace, Piper, and then I have Kenya, no, Lily Grace, Piper, Rico, then Kenya, London, Memphis, 
Aspen. <laughs> Soon will be Jersey, Mimi, Lulu, and Milani. That's 11. Then there's Paris, Me and More, and Baby Blessing, and Amani. I don't know. How many of her I got? I don't know. That's what I got so far. Uh, you know, then, you know, private babies or whatever. But there you have it, guys. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And I hope you guys have a wonderful night.